with my target writers, um, we were doing a group rotation in which they were working on electronic circuits. Mm -hmm. And there was quite a lot of complicated vocab there. And so what I did is I front loaded that with my target students first. And then they came in and they taught the rest of that group that vocab. And it just made them feel like experts. How yeah. important is that, that building mm. that mana for those yeah, children? Absolutely. That they're seen by their peers as the experts. Mm. There is a sense of urgency because we can't keep letting these children not be where they need to be in their learning. But part of that is part of our learning. There are some bits that we're kind of like, yep, yep, we can keep going with that. Then other parts, it's like, oh, hang on, we need to take a little bit more time with this. Learning's like that for our children. Learning is the same for us. There are bits that we can go through quite quickly, other bits that we really take our time and get right. If a child's not learning, it's not their fault. It's about thinking about what we can do as professionals to change that. It's about that spiral of inquiry. What's happening for this child? What is it that I need to be thinking about here? What learning do I need to do as a professional? Is it shifting that child's learning? And if not, well, don't keep doing the same thing and expecting a different result. It's about trying different things and monitoring the impact of those practices. I was able to go in and support and team teach. So I was modelling some lessons. I was working with groups in the class. I was observing this teacher. This teacher was observing me. It was just about collaborative practice and being able to bounce ideas off each other at the time. Yes, it's S-U-R-V-I-V-E. -E. Oh, thanks. We found that our targeted students would come into the writing lesson having a whole lot of mana around their knowledge and around their skills. The kids already knew what was going on. The children already had had a little practice with what it was they were going to be doing. They already had the vocabulary that sat underneath that. We would often use the targeted students' writing as an exemplar of what it could look like at the right level. It's about removing barriers to their learning.